A key. But I feel like something bad's gonna happen. Communications room, okay. He, he grabbed it so slowly, I thought something was gonna scare me. Okay. No! Oh! God damn it! Hello, my darlings. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new, please come in. Make yourself at home. My name is Patty Cake. Welcome to Patty Cake Games and Part 2 of Lazaret. Uh, where we left off last time, I was running for my life, and I failed. So we're going to try to make it this time. We're going to try to escape the little spindly creature with the creepy legs. Uh, he's chasing us through the thing after we got the battery into the generator. and uh, Or whatever into the generator. Anyway, we're running. That's the important thing. We're running. That's what we're doing. So yeah, we're going to continue this. We're going to get through the rest of the story. We're going to figure out what's going on on this ship. And uh, maybe get to safety. Or die trying. Because this is a horror game. Not all horror games have happy endings. So let's go ahead and get started with Lazarette. Guys, I'm really, really excited to get to the second half of this. This is supremely creepy. Before we get started, look down below the video. If you haven't yet, consider clicking on like and subscribe. It really does help out the channel and it makes sure you don't get haunted by creepy statues. Also, you can click the notification bell. That'll let you know when new videos get posted to the channel. And then if you look in the description of the video, you'll find a link to a bunch of social media. But the most important one is the Discord. Come and join the Discord. We have a, a growing community there that's really fun, and uh, they seem to enjoy the videos. So you can come and talk with them. All right, let's get started. Oh, I'm nervous, but we're gonna go ahead and load my game. Oh, okay. I just have to run. That's the important bit, yes? Uh, tab, yes? Escape the service deck, yes. And I don't know the way. Running, 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 running. Did I make it? I think I made it. Okay, that wasn't that bad. I thought I was gonna have to like go through twists and turns and dead ends, and no, it's just a straight shot to the elevator. We're fine. <laughs> now I have to fix the water pump. Do I remember who that is? No, I don't. But this will tell me. It's in here. But it's locked. Oh, because it's flooded. Duh. Okay. I just got to get to the pump. Okay, I'm watching you. Creepy ass statues. God, I can never tell if it's my footsteps or someone else's. Hello? All right. Dude, I heard him walking and then he was there. These guys have moved. They've totally moved. Oh, it's so, oh, so creepy. was that all right guys I'm watching you closely oh I think I found it yes Okay, I found the pump, and now we're going to, ooh, ooh, something bad happened here. Now we're going to go into the door I couldn't get into before, and hope I don't die. Okay, those guys are in the same spot, but I'm watching you. Oh, you weren't there before. You're new. Yeah, you were over here before. <laughs> so stupid. Okay. Um, okay. We made it. Okay. We 
made it. We made it to the next area. Ah, find the elevator up to the superstructure. Okay, I really, really wish I had a flashlight. Or flares. I'd be happy with flares, too. I see you. You're hiding in the dark there. Uh-huh, I heard you move. You turned towards me. That's locked. Shimmy on the side of this. Okay. Well. Okay, here we got a little bit of light. Oh, it's a fan. Okay. I was like, what is that sound? It's just a fan. Oh, we can save. Good. Oh, thank God. Save. Okay. Deck seven. Is this the elevator up to this the uh, superstructure? Oh! What the hell, dude? Why? And he's gone. The heck was that all about? The drive chain is missing. Okay, so we have to fix that. Okay, what is this? Did nothing. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, this door's been knocked off. Who did that? Was it the dude that knocked me down the elevator? He seems abnormally strong, if so. All right, it's missing a light bulb. So we gotta find a light bulb. Oh, seriously, more flooded, more flooded. I don't like all the flooded areas. It's really creepy. Oh, I see you in the corner there trying to hide. Oh! <sighs> God damn it. <laughs> Okay. Well, I found the light bulb. <sighs> We've made it down into the cargo area. We were told to stay in the superstructure, but no one goes up there anymore with what's happened to the medical deck. It should be safe down here, but to make sure nothing can follow us, we've removed the drive chain for the elevator. <laughs> okay. I'm not letting him out of my sight until I'm far enough away. Oh, gotta go around. Oh, hello. Yeah, I see you. I see you looking around the corner there. Nothing there, right? Yep, nothing there. Of course not. Okay, let's put this light in. Okay, now we can see. Kinda. It's not really much better, but... <laughs> okay, we can get in here. Apparently, we don't need a screwdriver for this one. This cabinet right here. I'd appreciate if you didn't do anything crazy. All right, there's nothing there. That was a waste. Oh, hello. I see you down there too. I guess I'm gonna have to walk past you to get to the storage room. Sir, yeah, document. More and more crew members are finding themselves on the medical deck. More patients are experiencing chest pains and worsening symptoms. Could it be contagious? The crew are growing increasingly, increasingly anxious. The best thing we can do is keep them quarantined on the medical deck. Between this fog, the engines going down, being missed by that rescue team, and now this sickness, it's becoming difficult to keep everyone calm. What the hell was that? Okay. Oh! No, 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 it's too dark. Oh, OK. 
Okay. Hi. You just hanging out in there watching me? Hmm? You think I wouldn't see you there? Yeah? Alright, well, I'm gonna grab this, uh, this wheel. I'm not sure what it's for, but I'm gonna grab it. It's a valve handle. Probably for a valve that needs to be opened or closed or something. And um, I'll go on my merry way. And I trust you won't knock me into any elevator shafts anymore. Okay, that statue's gone. I don't know where he went. It's none of my concern. Oh. Oh, okay. So I guess this is like... Great. Well, it came off. But I get to keep it. Did I get to keep it? Do I keep it? No, I don't keep it. It broke. Okay, never mind. <laughs> okay, yeah, so we can go into here now. That's creepy looking. It looks like tentacles on the floor. I can't see. What's over here? <gasps> no, yay. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Okay. Oh, I feel so much. Oh, it's rope. That's what I'm looking at. Okay. Watching you. You're not going to answer? I guess I'm too close, probably. Okay. Let's, let's go back to that dark area that I couldn't go into before. Oh! Who would have thought lights turning on would scare me so bad? Okay, let's go this way. <laughs> go, 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 go. Now we're going to go in this area back here that was too dark before. Okay, can't go in there. What about here? No, that's locked. Okay. Chain storage. Oh, that's probably where the chain drive is. We gotta get the key to that. Don't you move. Don't you dare. Well, you look bored. It appears that those who first started showing symptoms have spent more time on the main deck. Could it be exposure to the fog that's causing this strange sickness? Mm. So far, none of the crew who have been confined to the lower decks have gotten sick. I've been outside a few times, but thankfully my duties keep me mostly indoors. As a precaution, the captain has ordered that the crew are not to go above deck for any reason until further notice. That's probably wise. Although it, it apparently did not work. Yeah, I see you. You were going to jump scare me, weren't you? Well, ha! I beat you at your own game. Is this okay? Okay, so we have to find the order. Yes. Yeah, it's a memory game. Okay. No. Nope. Okay. Okay. No. Okay. One eight seven three. One eight seven three five. One eight seven three five. Two. Got it. <sighs> okay. Well, this is turned on. Oh. Okay. Really. How am I going to get over there? Wait, is he moving? I think he's moving. I can't tell. I can't 
tell. I don't want to get super close. <sighs> I knew it. I knew it. <clears throat> He's going to be gone now. Okay, yeah, we're fine. Okay. <laughs> it's just a stupid jump scare. Oh, gosh. That's horrifying. But okay. Yeah, let's... Let's do this. This seems safe. <laughs> All right, we made it into this room. Oh, dude. Yeah, okay, come on. God, what the hell happened in here? It's just littered with body parts. What is that? Is that a camera? No. It is! It's a camera! Oh, maybe some answers finally. Okay, I know where this is. the guy that was hanging out in the uh it is it's the guy that was hanging out inside the uh the container i bet or maybe not i don't know i could be no this is oh oh dude run oh that's this room It's just ripping them to shreds. Oh, they're becoming them. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. That's what's happening. Okay, yeah. We need to get off of the ship as quickly as possible. Over the last few days, the patients have been getting worse. What started as chest pain soon developed into a strange hardening of the skin and stiffening of joints until the patient is unable to move on their own. The illness is already proven fatal in some cases. Stranger still, some of the bodies have gone missing from the morgue. We need to get the remaining patients to a hospital as soon as possible. I did think to myself, I wonder if these are actually, the statues are actually what's left of the crew. The illness just made them harden into statues. But that doesn't explain where the little spidery things are coming from. Like, what causes that? That's totally different. Yeah, like, more of them turned into them here. Oh, is this where he was? I think this, yeah, this is where he was holed up. You can see it right here. That's the direction he was looking. I must be going mad. I've been seeing some of my friends again, but that's impossible. They're dead. I know they're dead. I saw it happen, but every now and then I see them again, watching me from across the room. Sometimes it feels like they're guiding me. But to what end? Are they friends? Oh! Or foe? A pressure gauge valve. Ah, that's the type of valve. Okay. That's... Nope, 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 nope. nope. Oh! No, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I don't know what I was expecting. Damn it. 
Uh, okay. All right, so we just need to run as fast as we can down this corridor. Hello. And up these ladder. And we made it up this ladder and we closed. Okay. 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 We. Oh, we made it here. Okay. Now we have the valve that we need for here. Okay. And then we can. No idea what I'm trying to do. I can't even see the thing. Okay, close. Let's try closing this one. No, it's too much. That's way down to four now. It resets every time they... Yeah, it sucks. Okay. Got it. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is a place you don't normally go on a ship. Oh, hi. Uh, what you got there? Chain storage key. Okay, thank you. Uh, I'm gonna go this way now. And I'm not gonna bother you again, Mr. Dead Body. Please don't. Oh god, now? The helicopter is fixed up and we're almost back to the ship. What's going on in there? Oh, dude, you have no idea. I'm headed up to the superstructure now to release the lockdown. I've searched the lower decks and found no survivors. Understood. We'll be there to extract you soon. We've just got a visual on the ship. Looks like it's coming up on a large... Oh, no, no, no! We had to get out of the fog bank! Do not enter the fog. I'll explain later. Well, you had better hurry, then. We don't have much time before the fog reaches you. Oh, great. Great, 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 great. Like, no, no mention of the fact that I'm being chased by weird spindly-legged monsters, that there's a giant guy that looks like he's from the, the crew of the Flying Dutchman chasing me around, that uh, there's a bunch of statues that seem to move when you're not looking. No, no mention of that. No, just... No survivors found. <laughs> okay. Uh, I need to go to where that door is, which is over here. Get this. Thank you. Okay, let's get a chain drive. Got it. Anything else in here? Any lore? No? Okay. To the elevator. Oh, I can't. Oh, you're taking forever to get here, dude. No, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, no. Oh, no, they're all coming. They're all coming. No. <laughs> Hurry up, elevator! 
It's gonna push back against the elevator. As soon as it opens, I'm gonna go in. Oh my lord. Go. Push the button faster. Hi. Hi. Oh, that was horrifying. Find a way to the bridge. <laughs> Level 3 security clearance is required to access the bridge. If you think you should have access but haven't been issued a key card, see the security officer on A deck. Okay, so we gotta go to A deck. Yeah, it needs a key card, of course. Okay. Okay, we're at A deck. Seriously? You just got up and ran through the door? With the chair spinning and everything? You've been watching. Someone's been watching. Right? Four, two, three, nine. Remember that. Until further notice, the security disk for creating new key cards will remain with me. Over the last few days, we've seen a number of crew members trying to gain unauthorized access to the bridge to release the lockdown. And that's a risk I'm not willing to take. Things will go back to normal once we're out of this fog and it's safe to lick the lock lift lick. To lick the lick the lockdown. To lift the lockdown, Captain Taylor. Okay. Okay, it's close this for now. I'm gonna do this part first. Uh, oh, okay. 1A, 1B, 1C, 1D. Oh! Really? <laughs> nope, running. Uh. It's locked! <laughs> I'm so gonna die. This is nowhere I can go. There's no place to go. I'm dead. Okay. Let's try again. Oh, that sounded visceral. Hmm. Something's missing from here. Weird thing to have us showing as a slide. Is it a Turk riding a horse? Oh! 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 Okay, okay. Um. Shit. Okay. Um. Oh, okay. Hiding spots. safe the music doesn't it's not scary anymore so I'm gonna assume it's safe oh I still hear him though It was not safe. It was not safe. Oh, okay. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. No. That doesn't have anything that I've seen before. Oh, that's, that's not ominous at all. Okay, it won't open. That's probably a good thing. Alright, so let's try going down another deck. Is there anything down here? C deck. Scott Ackerman, Miranda Layton, Nick Stafford, Edward 
Briggs, Krista Eldred, and Fred Moore. Storage. Okay, I'm going to close this behind me. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, hey. Four through three, nine. I bet this is it. Or maybe not. What we got? To all new recruits, welcome aboard. Your personal belongings can be stored in your designated locker in the storage room across the hall and the combination of which has been set to your birth year. Feel free to change the combination. Any bulkier items have been stowed in the cargo hold. Okay, so whose room is this? This would be room three. And room three belongs to... Nick Stafford. Uh, I guess you barricaded yourself in, but... Didn't do any good. You still turned into a statue. Showers. To the maintenance team. This morning I dropped my cabin key in the shower room, and I believe it may have fallen down one of the drains. If someone happens to find my key, I'd appreciate it if you could return it. The first officer. Can't be reached by hand, so I need something to get it out. G. Hackett. What did I need to pick up a nameplate for? Laundry. Oh, dude, you just completely left the room? That's messed up. Oh no, there you are. <laughs> oh, oh, gross. Gross. Uh, really, do you have to draw it out that much? <laughs> okay. Ah, 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 look what I found there. Okay, so I know what to do for the file cabinet puzzle now. Let's go take care of that. Maybe we'll find out Nick Stafford's birthday. Ah! Okay, okay then, game. Oops. Nick, uh, Nick Stafford, uh, February 13th, 1984, so two, uh, 1984, it's all, 1984, it's all I need to put, 1984. Okay. What's in here? A hook. Ah, string and a hook. All right, that's for the shower. Don't even think about it. Okay, that's the first officer key. So now we can. Oh, you just completely left, didn't you? Okay. I'm watching. You're going to jump scare me later, I'm sure. All right, let's go back up to the main deck, or A deck, I believe. <laughs> Let go of me. Who is this dude that's still somewhat alive? Blank key card. All right, that's one half of what I need. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
more. Oh, uh, okay. Reset. Reset. an idea 42.39 and this is the bottom floor D deck don't you even think about it I hear you walking okay that's locked what is that the library okay lounge Really? Really? You just draped sheets over their heads? Oh, that's not creepy. Jeez, could you make it scarier? Okay, so we got coffee. Oh, what's this? A key. A key! But I feel like something bad's gonna happen. Communications room, okay. He grabbed it so slowly, I thought something was gonna scare me. Okay. No! Oh! God damn it! Open! I don't know what floor of the communications room was on. I don't remember ever seeing that. So it might be on the same floor. Is he still here or did he leave? I think he left. Officer Mess. Oh, wow. Oh, okay, hang on. Being the chief mate, Norton sits at the head of the table. Blackwood and Ackerman like a glass of wine with their meals. Leighton sits opposite to Blackwood, and Hackett sits at the end of the table, closest to the galley. Okay, so, let's see. This is probably going to be the galley right here, right? Oh, dude, come on. Yeah, that's the galley. Oh, oh, no, come on. Okay, so who needs the... Okay, this is... Okay. Hang on. Norton sits at the head of the table. Oh, I have to get all of them. Okay, so let's take this one because there's one here. Okay, so Hackett sits by the galley. He's going to be right here, probably. Leighton likes... Which one likes... Alright, well, I figured I'd just get that over with, because he's going to be in the way otherwise. Okay. Blackwood and Ackerman like wine. Leighton sits opposite to Blackwood. Okay, so... So Leighton's going to be here. Communications. Close that behind me. Ah. Four, two, three, nine. Yes. Okay. 
What is this? International Morse code instruction manual. Crest. Crest. What does crest mean? C R E S T. Oh, okay. Making progress now. Library. Okay, back down to the bottom floor. Oh, it's this room. 4239. What have you got? You have something. Is that the thing that goes in front of the projector? Give it. Thank you. I appreciate it. Oh. Okay. Yeah, you've made your point. Oh, and a nameplate. Okay. Blackwood's nameplate. Okay. Let's go up to the conference room now. <laughs> okay. Okay, I feel like this went in a really weird direction. <laughs> Okay, uh, conference room is down here, right? It's playing here. these shadow puzzles. Okay. I had to press space. I'm just dumb. I didn't see that at the bottom. Okay. Oh, okay, here we go. Uh, we got stuff. We got a nameplate and 12725. 12725. Alright, I can get that. Go back to the first officer's quarters. Reset. Uh, reset. Uh, reset. Okay, reset it. Try it the other way. name tag okay so now we go back to the mess hall being the chief mate Norton sits at the head of the table okay, we'll start with that Norton sits at the head of the table so it's gonna be here okay this guy likes wine Layton sits opposite of black something Blackwood and Ack Ackerman like a glass of wine with their meals. Layton sits opposite of Blackwood. So Layton is here. So this is going to be Blackwood. 
And Ackerman will be here with the other bottle of wine. I keep doing that. Okay, that's it. And we got a key. Somewhere around the table. There it is. The captain's key. All right. We can get in the captain's quarters now. Ah! Nope, not that way. Well, that's no good. That was no good. Ooh, 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 ooh. That was that was another brilliant Resident Evil reference when Dad comes through the wall in the house when you're trying to get away. <sighs> okay, Captain's Quarters. Captain's Quarters. That's going to be down here. Right here. Yes? Uh, Captain? Captain? Is everything okay? I'll just... I'll just... Oh, you're gone. Okay. I'll just... I'll just leave you here to stew on that. Oh! Oh, son of a bitch, really? Oh, this is the place we're not supposed to be. Shit. I am terrified. What is that? Padlock key. Okay. Oh! Oh. <laughs> okay, yeah, it doesn't scare me anymore when it happens every time. Okay. There's another padlock. There's three padlocks. So I've got to get two more keys. Patients appear to be suffering from an unknown illness. The illness progression progresses as follows. One, the patient experiences intense chest pain, which will worsen over time. Fatigue begins to set in, and the color of the patient's skin begins to take on a paler tone. That was number two. Number three, the patient will begin to show signs of impaired mobility due to stiffening of the joints. And number four, x-rays show signs of calcification of internal organs beginning from the lungs and then spreading out throughout the rest of the body. This makes breathing difficult for the patient, which also lends credence to the fact that the fog is causing it because they're breathing in the fog, so the lungs would be affected first. Number five, calcification begins to affect the skin as well, giving the patients a stone-like appearance. Number six, the virulence of the illness seems to relate it to the length of exposure to the fog, with the quickest deaths occurring within two days, while others have survived up to two weeks. The cause of death is most, in most cases is respiratory failure caused by excessive calcification of the lungs. However, the process seems to continue even after death until the entire body has been calcified. That is a absolutely terrifying way to go. It reminds me of... Uh, what was that illness in Game of Thrones where they the, the stone stone illness where they turn to the rocket their skin gets hard? It's like a horrible, horrible way to die. Okay. No! Ah! Don't do that to me, Captain. Okay, I found a padlock key, I think. <coughs> Did he reach from underneath? Do I still have it, or did he take it from me?
No, I still have it. Okay. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> I stuck saliva down my windpipe because something startled me, and then um, it's causing me to cough. Oh. Why? Why? The morgue. Okay, is this the third padlock key? Please tell me it is. It is. Okay. <laughs> Go away! Just to make sure there's nothing in here. There's not. Let's get the hell out of here. All right. Uh, what was the whole thing I was doing? <laughs> I don't even remember. Uh... <clears throat> Oh, yes, making the card. Oh, not here. Here. Blank key card. Security clearance disc. All right, level three key card. Scott Ackerman. Let's go. Yes, we're here. I'm, I'm, I'm here. I'm getting into the bridge, dude. I'm going as fast as I can. Map deck. I made it to the bridge. Release the lockdown. The entire point of the game is to release the lockdown. And I finally here. I'm finally here. Uh, where do I do it? Here. Release lockdown. Yes. Get me the hell out of here, please. Guys, that was harrowing. <laughs> that was a really, really scary game. Oh my gosh, I had so much fun playing this game. I re highly recommend if you have not played it, play it. It's great. Uh, developer, excellent job. I loved this game. Aegon Games, keep it up. Make more stuff like this and I will play it. Uh, Thanks, guys, for coming by and watching this video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. I, next horror game, I'm not sure what it's going to be, but I'm, I've am i got some ideas. It's all kind of whirling in the head. Next week, we're going to be premiering a brand new game, so you want to make sure you tune in for that. Thanks for coming by. Make sure you click like and subscribe and join the Discord, and I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>